It becomes my idea for this painting, for this artwork that I uh, created. As you may see, like uh, there is in the middle is the icon of Indonesian element. It's called Gunungan, uh, which is part of um, wayang puppet performance, which was like used, which is used for the beginning to represent the beginning and the end of a performance, and it's also like representing life house like because inside there are plantations there are animals there are house so i think it's very nice to combine the idea of gunungan with the changing uh, of the city so besides the gunungan there are the, the old city of san francisco and the present city of san francisco and depicted with uh, the, the the skies different skies like in the morning the dawn and in the afternoon and i put the title as stories from the city because yeah, I can say that, that there are a lot of stories inside the city and different and so diverse and so rich. So that's become the, the core point of this uh, painting. But it's not there. The point is not only showing the differences or the changing of the city. But as I mentioned before, what is important for San Franciscan's people, for the, the people here to live here and um, what do they uh, want to stay or want to remain safe? the process uh, to to get that I did a lot of process to interview a lot of people especially people who passing by here or people who asking us about the painting and we start conversations and of course the sewers the sewers has been part of our project a lot because they have been here and communicating with us and bridging us with all the people who passing by so I also asked them and there are a lot of answers that's very interesting, that's intriguing, that's very challenging as well. So this is the answer I put at the below. Like the, the mentioning as the city changes, what is, uh, this is what the people want to remain the same. And there are a lot of heartwarming answers that I can say. And it's very beautiful, you know, to, to look at the city, how, how the city grows not as a city, but the people inside with a lot of communities, with a lot of differences, but what can unite them is the love itself. So the number seven is coming from, um, it's very interesting too, because there are a lot of people seeing an added value on the number, but at the beginning it's only because it's my birthday number, which I always use. <laughs> so, but it's also, for me, it's a complete number. Like from the Genesis also, when, when God created the, the, the world, it's taken seven days, like it's the idea of the wholeness, but also added by Louis that in the Greek um, traditions, number seven is also uh, the complete number. And by um, uh, Dylan, it's added like in casino, it's also seven, seven, seven. So it feels like there are a lot of interpretations for set number seven, but it's, uh, it's interesting to put the seven as the whole uh, wholeness of the idea of living. For myself, art is about voicing justice, about voicing um, uh, peace, and about voicing all the uh, the unity, like in this different world, different kind of thinking, different minds. I think it's very important to stay united, to stay um, like United States, <laughs> to stay united, to stay uh, together, to uh, stay tolerance, like understanding each other, but as well as uh, supporting each other. So I think that's what great about art that it can be that tools to communicate to a lot of people and especially empowering community and in fact if we can say like mostly the uh, marginalized community or the community in needs so it's very important always important <laughs> To being part of um, Asian Art Museum is 
more than just an experience. But it's also a very touching moment for me because as ASEAN in the United States, I feel like home.